What's up YouTube? Big Daddy here. Time for another food review. Today we've got some Pringles for you that I've never seen before. We've got Pringles Parmesan and Roasted Garlic. Pringles Fried Onion Ring. And the newest of the new, Pringles Scorching Cheddar. So we've got all three of these awesome Pringles flavors for you. And get them all in there. All right. What should we do first, mystery guests? We've got the mystery guests here helping me out with this one. Do you want to do scorching cheddar? Onion, onion ring? Mm -hmm. I'm going to try the onion ring. Pringles onion ring. Man, you know, Pringles is interesting because sometimes they, they get a flavor going and it's pretty good. And you're like, these, these smell and taste just like the thing that they're supposed to represent. So yeah, first, no. we got the onion ring. We're going to give it the whiff test. It Bear, Bear's over here. Meat. He wants to... It does smell like a fried onion ring. A little bit. Give it a whiff. Whiff it. It's not bad. Yeah, it smells like an onion ring. It does, right? It smells like a White Castle onion ring. <laughs> it does. It's weird. It does. Let's see. Let's see if Bear likes the Pringles fried onion. Bear, come here. You want, want one? Come here. Come here. I think he likes it. Truth is, Bear would eat anything. All right. Bear's a hoover. So here we go. This is the Pringles fried onion ring. Hmm. What do you think? When I initially... One other? Mm. When I initially taste it, it tastes like an onion ring. But as I chew, because it doesn't have the texture of an onion ring, it... The aftertaste feels okay, like I just Hold ate on. an onion ring. Like, after, you know, the aftertaste tastes like you ate an onion ring. No. To yeah, me, I think it tastes like it, but. To me, these taste like regular Pringles coated in onion soup mix. That's what it tastes like to me. It doesn't taste like an onion ring. I don't know. The. the you know, the aftertaste, to me, reminds me, makes me feel like I just ate onion rings. Really? Yeah. I don't know. I don't think so. After I've chewed and swallowed okay. it, it tastes like All right. I ate an onion ring. But just, it, it texture, obviously, I think it does. But All of these pretty know. much have the same exact statistics. 150 calories for 15 Pringles. 9 grams of fat. Total carbs, 15. Minus 1 for net fiber. Or net carbs of 14. So, and 1 gram of protein. So, that's your Pringles onion ring. This is the Pringles roasted uh, Parme uh, Parmesan and roasted garlic. I have a feeling Mr. Guest is not going to like this one as much. She's not a huge fan of Parmesan. She's What's making the she's making the face like she thinks it's well, going to smell bad. smell that. I'm gonna give it the old whiff test. You can whiff it on your own. See, this just tastes like smells like Pringles to me. It yeah, doesn't even smell I think cheesy. Your smeller's broken. Okay, well help yourself no, to I one. Don't 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 smell, don't smell it. it. Just help yourself to one. All right. Take a couple here. So this is. I like it. <laughs> Pringles, Parmesan and roasted garlic. I taste the garlic, for sure. Oh yeah, mm. I like this. Mm. You're right. Tastes the garlic a lot. Very garlicky. Which isn't bad because it dilutes the Parmesan right. smell. It's not as cheesy tasting. Yeah. Like if you've ever had like they have these new keto snacks that are like Ugh. like fried like little pieces of Parmesan that are all fried up or whatever, and they're you're supposed to eat them and they're just overly cheesy. They smell it almost tastes like barf. But this is, you, it tastes like barf smells. But this is really good, really garlicky. Yeah. 
They taste pretty good. Because I'm not a Parmesan fan, and I think they're pretty good. Yeah, I like them. One more. One other? Sure. All right. Now, the very last garlicky. one. Wow, very garlicky. Is the scorching cheddar. Scorching cheddar. Looks like it's going to be hot. You got the red chip. The fire on the can. I have a feeling. It's not a chip, that's a chili pepper. No, chili pepper's down here. Yeah. The chip is kind of reddish. Mm -hmm. Let's see if it's reddish in real life. Bear, I can't give you this one. It's spicy. You won't like it. Okay, it's not as red as it was on the on the can. See them in there. You have like a red powder. Yeah. So, give it the whiff test. This smells like Pringles. Here you go. Tony, your smell is broken, though. All right, so we got these scorching cheddar. Mm. Wow. <clears throat> Very singy. Very zingy. Mm -hmm. When it first hits your tongue, you can hit that, feel that. Eat. But the question I have for you is, do you find it to be that cheesy? Yeah, I think it's a little cheese. I think it's a little cheese. Yeah. But more heat. Mm hmm Sure. So this is more heat than cheese. It's it's cheesy, but much definitely kind of scorching. Yeah, Woo. definitely can feel. The, if you ate this whole heat, if you ate this whole can, it would heat up. Yeah. It's tingling in the back of my throat. You know the little dangly ball that wow. <laughs> hangs over your is it a uvula? I think it's called uvula. Yeah, well, you're fifty one, shouldn't you know? This? I don't know. Uh, <laughs> I am not a medical professional. Nobody calls it the dangly ball. I don't dangly, think. Some, a lot of people call it the dangly ball. <laughs> some people call it a dingle ball, but that's not, that's a totally different thing. But these are very, wow. very spicy. Wow. Um, okay, so as far as the ratings go, Mystery Gus, mm -hmm. what do you give the fried onion ring? The roasted parmesan and the scorching. Um, I'd say you need to turn the parmesan or the it's fried good. onion ring better. They're not fully in the camera. It's just oh, purple, okay. blue, and um, I need a drink. Ooh. I would say on the onion ring, I'd give it a four and a half. Okay. On the parmesan roasted garlic, I'm gonna give them a five because I think they. Well, no. I'd give them a four and a half because I don't taste the Parmesan on them. I think they're good, yeah, but I don't taste the Parmesan on them. Okay. And the scorching cheddar. cheddar. Um, I'm going to give a four because I think the heat overpowers the cheddar. Okay. I am going to give the onion ring one a three and a half. I think it's good, but to me it doesn't. It has an onion flavor, but it doesn't taste like an onion ring. I think it does. I don't think it does. I think Big Daddy's nose and tasters. The broken. Parmesan garlic, I'm going to give this one a four and a half because, again, I don't really taste the Parmesan that strongly. Which is fine But the by garlic me. is coming through clear as day. And the scorching cheddar, I'm going to give a four and a half as well because it's scorching but not very cheddar to me. Right. I think it's got a little cheese but not that much. So we got three and a half and two four and a halves on all these Pringles flavors. And that's pretty much it, guys. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Hit subscribe, tap that notifier bell, so you know when the next video comes out. And remember, before you take the first bite, you gotta stuff it in your pile. Go Bears.